Okay, so here I have this uh, vintage art metal piece that has a really beautiful intricate design on it. The finish is gunmetal, which makes it look a little flat, but we can see that there's a gorgeous design under there. I do a lot of painting and I love using the vintage patinas with these. I also like just simply sanding and reliefing these, which um, will shine up the, um, the design in here and just really give us some contrast. So I'm using the vintage sanding block here, which are very nice. Your fingers will get dirty. <laughs> Okay, so I finished my sanding up off camera here so I wasn't shaking the camera around. And as you can see, just doing a little sanding has really relieved the pattern in there. And look at how nice that looks. It just really makes the beautiful design in there pop. It is a dirty finger job for sure. I generally have some uh, handy wet wipes at my work table when I'm doing this kind of stuff and I'll use that to just kind of wash off any of the residual stuff that I sanded off as well. So there you go. You can instantly transform some of these art metal pieces into something that just looks totally different in a matter of seconds with sanding. And the vintage blocks work fantastic. Whoops. Um, so the sides are what you want to start with, either this side or this side. They're all just a little bit different. But then this smooth gray side will actually polish up and make it look a little more shiny as well. So these are a fantastic product. All right, that's it, everybody. Happy creating. Have fun.